section of crystal practice management, um, updating the uh, patient settings. You load the patient up. Uh, you'll notice it's no longer using the uh, doctor signed here. It will use the employee that's logged in. We go to the drug RX tab, click e prescribe. It currently loads test Johnny, um, and here's his information. I'm going to change his phone number and his street address. So right now it's 1234 for his phone number and Contra's Trail for his address. And change his phone number to 9999 and his address to uh, Main Street. And I'm going to SSO again. You'll notice his phone number and his address have both changed. Um, that's because uh, when I did send over the SSO, initially it said, does this patient exist? It found out the patient did exist. Uh, then it said, update the information. Um, if the patient didn't exist, it would have created that patient from scratch. Um, let me demonstrate that now. I'm just going to load up a patient that's never been loaded before. Um, under the drug or exodus, click e prescribe. And it actually, during while it's creation, it's saying the patient's zip code is invalid. So let me go ahead and update that. prescribe and it created this patient um, with this information in the street address.